Yes, and I'm going to sound that, that and do a sound thing then. So don't worry, it's the way my sound. But this is a Taurus reading from the 7th to the 13th of February. Um, angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like Taurus to know? This is the third time I've done this reading, Taurus. So Taurus, angels, spirit guides. <laughs> For Taurus, please, angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like Taurus to know about the 7th to the 13th of February, please? 7th to the 13th of February. 7th to the 13th for Taurus. Angels, spirit guides, universe. Would you like Taurus to know about the 7th to the 13th of February for Taurus, 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 Angels for the week. For the week, really, and the weekend of that Valentine's. So, Taurus, we need some love in the house. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Taurus, 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 you do have the Ace of Cups there, something. Angels, Spirit Guides, Universe. Oh, and the Devil. <laughs> Taurus. Oh, God. Right, okay. On the bottom of the deck, we have Strength. You will have the power to get out of your confine this week to fight the ego and the lion. You could be dealing with a Leo. So, Taurus, we've got the Hermit and the Hierophant. So, this is very significant this week. As I said, it's been three takes for this video. I don't know how to edit or splice things. I just, not yet, I don't. So the Hermit is Virgo. Follow the light at the end of the tunnel. Um, there's a commitment to this spiritual path, but something needs to end. And um, you could have been in a third party relationship. Um, you could have been committed to a Virgo. Um, the Hierophant is the Taurus. It's like your element is here. You need to follow what the, the God path at the moment. Um, the Three of Swords is an ending with tears. We have the Ace of Cups. There's a new uprush of feeling coming in. And it could be to do with the promotion at work or it could be to do with somebody at work. Um, but you're very committed to this light at the end of the tunnel. And maybe you will end something so that you can be have new a new home, a new heart a new job um you will be at the crossroads you have got all the power and the tools at your disposal you're going to choose a path um to work on yourself to work on your coin there's swift arrows of love coming in and a clear stretch of, of creative activity with this eight of wands um the, the magician can make things go up or down an aquarius uh vibration he what it's like from 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 this point onward you have to make one of these roads a success and you can't blame anyone else if it's a failure okay you've got the magic wand you have to manifest the the outcome to any one of these paths to to your desire okay look at this um there's a magician. <laughs> you can just magically magic stuff, you know. Um, Eight of Pentacles here is working on his own coin. He's quite happy doing it. He's built up a sort of a reputation. The Eight of Wands, this is this creative activity. Someone could be coming towards you. You could be traveling this week. But listen, Taurus, the devil is here, the Capricorn. Um, He's got these puppets on a string. There's manipulation going on. So whoever's coming towards you could have a drink problem with this nine of cups upside down. And what should be a dream come true because of this toxic behavior seems that it upsets a wish. Yeah, a wish come true is don't over drink with that nine of cups. Um, this person could be te very temptation, very tempting, um, but really concentrate on that hermit your first card that you could be on your own you could be hermited in you could be committed to this path that you're doing um, and i would advise really strongly dedicating yourself to that not that you don't have to have, can have love and swift love communication um, and maybe you want this sexy time because you've been in this commitment or you've been hermited in but it's it's not that wish it's like close but no cigar do you know what I mean? So hold on to your strength here. And I'm seeing the world again, this travel. That did come up in your last reading. Lots of travel. Let's ask 
the angels. What they'd like Taurus to know, and I'm going fast because I'm fighting this is going to run out again. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Taurus to know about the week of the 7th to the 13th? 7th to the 13th. It's basically almost the same message as, as Aries got. Um, angels, spirit guides, what would you like Taurus to know? Okay, so we've got engagement. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment. We've got new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Angels. This person could be abroad. There could be lots of communication this week. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. And playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Okay, so... You're probably just wanting you're just wanting out of this commitment or out of the past you're doing new things you're you, you're gonna be playful you're still working on yourself um there's new love here with this eight of ace of cups there's new feeling um it could go to a level of engagement but possibly don't make it too sexual or toxic don't drink too much not not have sex but don't drink too much because you you will regret it because this this new love can go towards an engagement you're ascending let's ask the angels what they'd like taurus to know taurus 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 it's saying you can be playful there it could be a capricorn could be aquarius could be um uh taurus virgo there's lots of sun um sun signs here Angels, spirit guys, what would you like Taurus to know about the week of the seventh to the um, seventh to the thirteenth of February? Okay, what do you desire right now? Visualize it, and it will come about. Negativity will block your progress. So she's she's literally in her wedding dress, draw painting her own flowers. All right, manifestations with that magician. You can manifest whatever you want. I am the angel of abundance. You will receive the money that you need and God is in charge of how that will happen. Okay, so you could be working hard down here thinking when's the coins going to come in? But the, you might be selling things online too, but the swift arrows of love and communication are coming in this week. Um, and it's very sexy. Just don't overindulge there. <laughs> Breathe, it says. <laughs> Take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy to release old patterns and overcoming difficulties Taurus the worst is now behind you, you and you are surmounting any previous challenges um fantastic this is fantastic so this could ascend to a commitment with this this um it could be connected with a virgo or, or a capricorn um there's a lot of water here too so Take care of yourself, Taurus. Please like, share and subscribe. I'm in the process of, of doing a website where you can book a reading. And um, I will speak to you soon. That's thegiftingstosusie.com. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.